Hello from Mexico and welcome back to our YouTube channel. So today I'm going to take you guys down to the house site and I'm going to film a house update. If you saw our short, I also bought some fruit trees this morning. So I'm going to take those down so they can get planted. But I know it's been a while since we've had a house update. There's been a lot going on, which I'll cover in this video. But I hope that you guys enjoy. So if you like what you're watching, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe. Let's uh, head down to the house site. earlier and got Dominic because he was feeling better and I forgot to send the trees with him. So Diego and I are carrying them down and we're walking to the house site. We have to stop in at my sister-in-law's, drop off one of the Primo sweaters that they left at our house and then we'll get to the house site, get these planted and also give you guys an update on the house. And uh, we'll show you our walk along the way. <laughs> it's quiet today. Yeah, it's like three o'clock in the afternoon. Where is everybody? Oh, it's because the kids are out of school. <laughs> That's why. Because nobody's in school. I was like, where are all the moms? <laughs> um, most of the time, most of the kids just walk. No, their moms come and get them. I always pass them. Yeah. She's getting all the debris out of her corn. Mm -hmm. Passing the church. It's like our halfway point. Almost to my sister-in-law's. Ah, buenas tardes. Oh. Buenas tardes. Mami no se sombró mi árbol en mi casa. No vamos a pasar su casa porque mi árbol es muy grande. Es cierto. Sí, una de manzana y una de ciruela. Me voy a ensombrar en mi casa. Va a hacer un huerto ahí. ahí. ¿Y Dominic? Se van allá con mi marido. Pero no recuerdo, Pugina, estás en el carro, mira. Bien mensa. The campos all turning green right now. Looks so pretty. By August, it'll all be really tall and green. It's gonna be amazing. Now we're at the point where the road bends. So almost to the house. All right, so it's super windy on this part, but look at the fog over there on the mountains. The clouds are so low. Beautiful. This is my favorite part. Usually it has shade. There's no shade today, but the wind's pretty cold. So I'm actually glad I put a sweater on. Almost there. There's the house. <laughs> and Fidel's standing on top of it. <laughs> so these fields have been, um, they were planted earlier, so it looks a lot more green over here as you can see. This is the best part of the year down here. It's when everything gets super green. We're here at the house site. Fidel's working. Dominic's with him. Where are my dogs? Hola. Monta los perros. Los perros. Oh, ahí está. My lazy dogs. Not even rushing to say hi or nothing. Rude. Hi, babies. Hi. Hi, Pika Pika. Ellie, Maya, Jackson. It looks like Dominic and Fidel have been eating tunas, so glad Dominic's feeling better. <laughs> now we're here at the house site and I'm gonna take you guys up to the second floor and show you what Fidel has been doing. Look at these dogs sunbathing on my second floor. What are you doing, Ellie? You're a weirdo. Ellie, what are you doing? 
Y'all are weird. Okay guys, so Fidel is up here working right now. What they've done is they've got more of this wall put up in preparation to do the roof. Now they do have this wall over here completed. The This will all be filled in and that's where the bovedia will sit on top of these and on top of those. And then they'll put in, or well, Fidel will put in the windows for our bedroom. But then they also have all of this prepared. It looks like he's got one more level to do on that wall and then the very back wall as well. Now, if you remember from the walkthrough of our house, our bedroom has a very tall wall on one side of it. So this is that wall. I'm gonna go down. So that is the closet and that is the uh, primary bathroom. And so this is our bedroom right here. And so this wall is finished minus just the um, place where the bovedia sits and then the windows will be on top of that. Now, if you remember from the last update, all of these, um, ¿Cómo se dice estas? Castillos. Castillos. All of these castillos were laying down because they were putting them together. They put these together by hand. They do have these in place and ready. They've started putting them in place. Well, Fidel's started putting them in place over here as well. But as you can see, each one of these um, places where you can see the rebar sticking up, each one of those has to have one of these castillos. So they have a lot more to make by hand um, so that they can get those put up because they can't start putting in the talvique and the walls for the second floor until all of these are in place. Right now, Don Jose is doing another job closer to Pueblo City. He's almost finished with that, which means he'll be back at our house site in two weeks. Tomorrow, all of our workers will officially be back at work. So it won't just be Fidel anymore. All of our workers will be back. So tomorrow, what they're going to do is they're going to start marking out the walls for the second floor. They're going to continue working on these castillos that you see here so that they can get the rest of them put into place. And then by then, we're hoping that we'll have the rest of our talvique. Now, our talvique has been delayed. Um, it's We've had... We've had a lot of material delays lately, but our talvique has been delayed a little bit. Uh, we ordered it, I think, almost two weeks ago. So we're hoping that they'll have that here by the end of the week, because as soon as they have the rest of these castillos put up and the walls all marked out, they can start putting up the walls. At the same time, what we're hoping to be able to do is allow Don Jose to finish the colado on the garage so that that's finished. And then we'll just have the bedroom and then our final colado after that. So where Pika is just so casually laying, we have um, dos viajes de arena and dos viajes de grava. These are for the uh, colado. So it is to colar the cadenas and colar the techo. So we have all of this in place. It's just waiting for Don Jose to get here. We do have part of the cement, but that's mainly for the guys to work. And we have more of the rebar and that for them to make the castillos. Did go live on TikTok. If any of you were in there, thanks for going or coming to it. Um, Dominic is currently asleep in the back seat of the car, but we're gonna go get these trees planted because we're gonna head home after this because I have Spanish class at 7 p.m. tonight. So let's go find a place to plant the trees. I have a no idea what kind of bug this is, but what is that? I'm recording it. Maybe you guys can identify it. Don't eat it, Pika. <laughs> what is it? Okay. ¿Qué dices, Fidel? Tiene un otro nombre. Solamente que yo las yo antes porque jugaba jugaba con ellas cuando estaba chiquito y y con ellas yo pensé que eran eran como mi carro porque con ellas como eran muy grandes de aquí de la de su panza muy muy gordito yo pensé que era una pipa como de cuando cargar para cargar gasolina Ajá. y yo las jugaba con ellas no 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 es nada pero no morder no no ah, tiene su nombre no me acuerdo cómo se llama no me acuerdo cómo les decimos pero esta es. if you guys know the proper name si sabes la nombre? la nombre dile nosotros en los comentarios comentarios tell us in the comments vamos para 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 vamos a sembrar los árboles de cambio ahora ¿Qué son? ¿Qué árboles son? Son de manzana y ciruela. Manzana y ciruela. Ajá. Tienen de razón también, pero yo no tienen efectivo por todo. Y él no aceptamos tarjetas. Entonces, yo es un manzana y un ciruela. Y los 
Aguacates. Aguacates. Mi aguacate es, es este. Se lo comí la, 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 la. Si mira el aguacate en la mesa. Sí. Ajá. Ese es aguacate, creo yo. Ajá. Sí es. Sí es. Tienen verdes o unos son listos por comer a, a, ahorita. ahorita. Sí. Para comer ahorita. Here comes Diego with the wheelbarrow. I almost forgot to update you guys on the plants. So here's Fidel's plants, his corn. It's coming in nicely. Pika, don't step on the corn. These guys always step on them. I was not doing an update on Pika. <laughs> Diego said that Fidel gave him an impossible task. He is spilling the water. All right, I'm gonna plant them here with my other fruit trees. And also, I got some sweet corn seeds that I planted a couple weeks back. So, these guys are doing good. Hopefully I'll get some sweet corn. I can't remember what, I think he planted something else, but I can't remember what else he planted. But I think I'm gonna put my trees in this area. Second round of water and the trees. All right. Diego's digging one, and I'm gonna dig one, and Fidel's gonna record. <laughs> uh -uh. Diego and I are seeing who can dig faster. <laughs> Ok, mira, so, el hombre dice que por aquí, todo, por aquí por abajo. Ahí está, perfecto. Oh yeah, that was good, good job. Let's see if you... Alright, so getting Diego's in. Vamos a tener más agua, vamos a tener agua. Hold on Diego, you gotta put water in it. Tengo más tierra. Casi su árbol por mientras. Solamente porque faltaba tierra a la, a la bolsa. Ah. Hey Jackson. Uh, I'm planting fruit trees, Jackson. Not well executed. <laughs> I thought. Okay, now he's gonna put water in mine as well. Here's Diego's. And... <laughs> oh, okay. So then we put the water, and then we just have to put the, the rest of the dirt. Esa es mi otra ciruela. Mm. She's doing good. I'm mad at it. I think so. Yeah. <laughs> so he puts the water in and then he finishes filling it up with dirt. And then we'll show you guys how he makes a little moat around it so that the tree can get as much water as possible. Abas. Pero por qué es muy bajo? No, muy bajo. It's pretty far down there, Fidel. Aquí está ya. Oh. Oh, he does have abas. Cool. Oh, sí, cierto. Ya vamos por salir. Oh, we'll put him back so he can grow. Sorry. Thanks for digging him up for a second, though. <laughs> okay, back to planting. It's one of the trees that, or one of the things we brought back from Oaxaca, from Beth's house. Mm -hmm. Seems to be doing well. 
Okay, then he's gonna step around it because it's gonna look a little bit like this where the dirt is indented so that the water will run into it when it rains. See how he's making it like around it? All right, both of the fruit trees are planted and with the rest of them. That is gonna wrap up this house update. We did get the fruit trees planted. We've got Diego and Fidel coming up behind me. The wind started, so it's getting really cold. Dominic's still sleeping in the car. Um, but uh, yeah. So we're gonna head home. I'm gonna take my Spanish class and you guys will, uh, well, we'll get this posted as soon as possible. So as always, thank you so much for being here. We hope everybody has a good night. Bye guys. Bye.